is Arachne eating a mealworm and munching on that for like a good two, almost three hours now. She's hungry. Hungry fucking spider. My first tarantula owning. It's a uh, pumpkin patch tarantula. Obviously, a sling is what she is. Pretty cool. I have a uh, another one coming tomorrow. Got a curly haired tarantula, that'd be my second one to have. Um, I don't know how to start. I think they're really cool. I'm not gonna collect a whole bunch from them, but definitely like, definitely like them. They're pretty cool to watch to eat. Yeah. So her name's Arachne, and I'll show off the other one tomorrow. Well, even though I'm blurry there for some reason on the camera, sorry. She's in a jar, so. That's how little she is. She's little. She's, she was so little. This is my first one. So, you know, I took her out and tried to put her in the cage. This cage right here, actually. Behind there, you know, I didn't know she was going to be that small. She slipped right through those cracks. I had to catch her, and I guess I made one of her legs fall off. So, but she's doing fine. I guess it happens to a lot of people who's beginning to take care of spiders. The occasional leg is going to get knocked off. But she's doing fine, spinning webs, eating, running around. She's fine. So she's going to be a seven-leg spider. She's not going to get too big, about four or five inches. But, you know, we'll wolf spider, good-sized wolf spider that you find outside or something. She's not the biggest tarantula that you, that you can get. She's uh, considered dwarf tarantula is what they are. But, very... Pretty, pretty kind of sorry for the blurriness. Phone kind of sucks, but you can kind of see the the pattern on her. She's just munching on that worm. Um, oops, blanket in the way. Sorry about that. Yeah, so I think I'm gonna start just making new videos on tarantulas. Hopefully, I can get some views. You know. Usually I do video game stuff, but, you know, just trying something new. You know, I see a lot of people are really interested in watching tarantulas on their thing, and, you know, probably won't make it far in this, but I'm sure trying. They're really cool. Come on, bro. So she's so tiny. Even the phone is hard to focus on her. Um, yeah, but I uh, I named her Arachne. It is a uh, goddess of spiders, Greek mythology. Don't know much of the story. I just thought it was a pretty sick name, and you know, arachnophobia, Arachne. So yeah. I'll show you the other one tomorrow when I get him. He's going to be pretty cool. He's going to be a lot bigger, I hope. I don't know if they sent me a sling or what. Or I think he's going to be a teenage, but I don't know. That's the way you can see. I hope he's not this small. But what well, I can see, he's supposed to be. It's a curly haired tarantula. The next one. I, so I bought this one, right? I got her for 40 got her for 40 bucks and then the company that I bought it off of they offered me another one like a couple days later to my email they offered me a $10 tarantula for purchasing my first tarantula because I told her this is my first tarantula I purchased you know because you can leave a little comment so and basically they told me um or well not told me but basically I got an email Saying that I can have another tarantula for ten bucks. 
shipping, overnight shipping was free, when it's usually 45 bucks, but it was free this time. And I got the transcript for 10 bucks, so I got two of them. So she'll be here tomorrow, or he. This one's a girl. I got another one for the big guy. And they're not always, they can't always get you what you want, but you can ask what you want. So, but this one, they actually did. They actually got a female for me. So, and females usually last longer, so. Pretty fucking cool, though. And just wait until she's bigger, though. To see some colors really pop. Let's see if I can maybe get some light, maybe. No? It's kind of hard. Sorry, guys. First video of this kind of stuff, so. Not going to be the best. Yeah, no, it's really hard to get her on. I have to get, like, a better light for this type of stuff. But. Still, she has these pretty orange fucking, hard to see, yeah, there you go, right there, right there, right there, there you go, look at her butt, pretty orange spots right there, and that's, that's why they call her pumpkin patch tarantula right there, is because they got a nice dark, and their butt looks like a little pumpkin patch, you can look them up on Google, they're pretty good, they're, they're, I think if you're wanting to do with your tarantula, it's definitely a good, first tarantula but I don't know like you just gotta be ready for this because they are they are a small sling unless you find somewhere where they order you and they're giving you an adult but they are a really small I mean like look at her she is really small she's a really small sling and they're really hard so you gotta be ready they're fast and this one's both she likes to the uh, I don't know what you call them I don't know what the class is but she's both she likes to make trenches and like web up on sticks and stuff they're really good webbers and really good making trenches if you let them so Julie where's her little her little trenches I wish she's at right now yeah yeah that's yeah you kind of kind of see in there under that stick is where she made her trench it's nice and somewhat deep like a couple like an inch deep and you can kind of see right there in the jar that there's like a little thing she dug out they're really they're really cool to watch you know that's definitely not something uh i would i'm not gonna hold in my hand even when she gets bigger and even my other ones i'm just not like i'm scared of them i just you know they got hairs and I, in my opinion these kind of pets in my opinion I don't think you should handle them all the time. Like, if you want to go on and take them out and have them on your hands, sure, go on. That's you. But in my opinion, I think I like just having them in a nice area and feeding them and making them happy that way. You know, I don't really, you know. And it's not like in the wild they have human contact always touching them, you know. So I try to just let them do their thing. I like watching them. I'm not really big on whole touchy crawl over my hands, you know. I'm, I'm not really down for that, but. I'm more of the uh, kind of guy that just, I like to observe, watch them. She's just, she's munching away on that. And I'm actually really surprised. You know, they said to feed uh, slings like uh, two to three times a week, I think. A week, yeah, two to three times a week. And I think this is like my, I don't know. I put a couple of foods, see, because I got... I got these tropical spot roaches. I put one in there, but I don't know if she ate it. I think it just dug down, and, and now it's under her, so I think it's still in there. But she loves these. These are the mirror worms. Classic, you know. Everybody should know those. And then, she, not bad on these. These are grasshopper legs. Or, well, grasshoppers. But I, what I do is I just I pull the leg off, and I just put them in there, and actually... Might be able to. Legs are kind of dark. Yeah, it's kind of hard to see. Yeah, right there. It's right there under that branch. You could maybe see it bending right there. That's a grasshopper leg. She'll go over there and munch on that. She was munching on that, but earlier today, I put that. Where is she? She is. I put that worm in there, and right there in the middle, and she let it. She let it dig down. She let it dig down 
all the way. And then she went after it and pulled it out and teared it up and started eating it. And she's just been chewing on it here and there. And she's just falling eating it now. Um, the thing about these spiders, they do start off obviously really small. But they're supposed to be fast growers. I can't really look up how long it takes. I'm, I'm sure if I go in hard, hardcore try to read more. But, you know, I can't find, like, you know, how long, you know, how long it takes. But they're supposed to be really fast at growing. So... I would imagine maybe only, um, since it's so fast, I would imagine maybe only maybe a month or two, you know? I don't really know how fast spider growth is. Like I said, first spider, or first tarantula, whatever you want to call them, you know? But they're cool creatures, they really are. And, you know, so, she's munching around on that mealworm, pretty sick. I think that's really all I got for you guys, I mean, why don't you munch away? Alright, yeah guys, well thanks if you guys happen to do watch this video. I hope the, well it's not really a help out video, but I hope it shows you how tiny a fucking pumpkin patch tarantula sling is. And, you know, shows you, uh, you know, how they eat. And like I said, I think I'm going to start doing daily, not maybe not daily, but I think I'm going to start doing like maybe some weekly videos on these spiders. You know, watch them grow up, watch you get big. This is, I just got it the other day, I think, uh, um, Wednesday, I think it was. So, last Wednesday, so, yeah. We're going to make videos and involve and you're going to watch you grow up, basically. So, if you like that. Um, oops, I don't know what that just did. But, uh, if you like that, please do hit that like up button. Uh, stay tuned. There'll be more spider videos, more tarantula videos, whatever you like to call them. And, uh, yeah. Well, I'll see you all tomorrow when we see the new tarantula. But for later, no. Archie, Arch, yep. Arachne says, peace out. She's gonna be a munchin' and she's outies.